Hi, my name is Hani Faraj with Bank of Our House Finance, and today I want to talk to you about why I refer all my customers to a mortgage broker as opposed to a person that works at a bank. Um, again, this is Hani Faraj with Bank of Our House Finders, and the reason why I use a mortgage broker, an independent mortgage broker, over somebody who works at a bank is a couple of reasons. Number one is a mortgage broker takes an application one time. Uh, they have access to every bank for the most part, except some of the major uh, banks. Like, so they don't have access to like RBC, CIBC, or uh, BMO, but they have contacts there. So even if they can't do the deal, they usually have friends and, and people that work there, so they'll refer the business there. Uh, second thing is usually they have a plethora of options, meaning they they tend to be a little bit not so cookie cutter. Uh, if you know what I mean. So they tend to be a little bit more creative when putting deals together um, because they have so many options of lenders and stuff. Um, basically, they're a little bit more, I see, flexible. So one time I had multiple people go to the bank, get declined, come back. We get, we, we kind of get them again. Uh, we get them approved again by a mortgage broker, which is kind of amazing. Now they're, they've now they own property, which is amazing. Uh, and the third thing is I like independent mortgage brokers as opposed to bank employees. And again, there's nothing wrong with bank employees is that they don't get paid unless you're happy. So imagine I'm a bank employee and I work nine to five, Monday to Friday. Sometimes I don't even work certain, certain weekdays. And you're a broker. I mean, you're, you're a person who's looking to buy. Well, you're most likely super nervous. You're like, hey, what's going on with my mortgage? Hey, what's going on with my mortgage? And these people, no offense, they have other clients and they're on the clock. They go to lunch on, you know, certain time or whatever. And there's nothing wrong with that. Some people like to work with those people. Personally, I don't. So sometimes if I have a broker, I'll call them and basically I'll say, hey, man, what's going on with my deal? It could be Sunday. It could be Monday. It could be any day of the week. It could be 10 o'clock and the guy will pick up because he knows I'm, I'm super stressed about it. Okay. So if you want that kind of level of service, please contact me. I could definitely refer you to a couple of good mortgage brokers that I have. Um, and I'll tell you, if you are going to deal with a bank person, please call me. I also have contacts there. I have good contacts at CIBC, RBC. Uh, like I think even BMO, we have a really good contact there. So it's not like I'm opposed to them, but I only work with select people that I know are good. And they'll talk to you after hours because I know it's super nerve wracking. Okay, guys. Thank you so much. I hope this video was very helpful. Please subscribe, uh, add notifications to the channel, as well as share with any other per person that you might think would be a benefit from this. Thank you so much. Have a good day.